It's February already. And another chance for Immortal Iron Fist. Let's go. How's it going, everybody? Rob Von Chu here. Hope you guys are having a most excellent start to your February. It is February already. And with that comes a chance uh, to open and I'm sure to fail again at getting a five or six star Immortal Iron Fist. I'm going to be going through and cleaning up some of the stuff here, including the daily login. I've got a featured six star to open up at the very end. Uh, a couple of Nexus five stars as well. And, uh, you know, we'll, we'll see how it winds up going, right? Starting off with the login crystal here. These are always just so fun to uh, always not get my hopes up for a five star. I've gotten it once in the history of ever. I've gotten it once. But, I mean, it's super scroll, so it's not like it's uh, super riveting in the first place <laughs> anyway. Next up, we got the Daily Throne Breakers here. Uh, I have yet to wind up getting the 10,000 uh, six-star shards. Hey, that's a... Whoa! 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 Yes! That was a full! That was a full tier 5! That was a full tier 5! That was the second one I've ever gotten. Ever. And a bunch of uh, tier 4. Dude, that's so good. That's so good. Team Pop, man. Team Pop is where it's at so far. And then, uh, sure, I'll take the five star. That's cool. Bunch of formed stuff. Wow. All right. Let's keep the show on the road here, huh? Uh, no, I will not be taking that disgustingly overpriced offer. Thank you. Do another uh, quick pop right there. Man, tier four for days. That's great. I think that's a uh, tier two out of there as well. I didn't see a formed thing pop up. So a full tier five and a full tier two plus a bunch of tier four. A second tier two. Dang, man. Man, this month was stacked. <laughs> that's so good. That's so good. I'm just going to rapid pop through these objective crystals. It is, like I always like saying on these uh, cleanups, these are my favorite to open because they are the easiest uh, crystals to get. Just play the game, basically. Uh, and the loot is usually pretty solid as well, relative, of course, to the effort you got to do to get it in the first place. 300 six-star shards, nice. And another awful offer. No, thank you. Some uh, tier one alpha, cool. Sweet, sure, I'll take it. Got a bunch of these four stars that I've honestly I've got no use for anymore. I'm just gonna rapid pop uh, 20 of them just to uh, move things along with the the max sigs for the Iron Fist. We'll probably get to that next if you know the game decides it wants to work. There we go. Cool, because everything here is a max sig. Everything's a max sig. I mean, I did, uh, no, because I, I saw Kitty Pride coming up first, and uh, now she's maxed out too. Like, any chance I get is Spidey 99, that's cool. Yep, even he's maxed. Like, anytime I get a new champion from an arena grind, then I just throw SIGs on him to max him out there, just because then I've got SIGs in overflow I can't do anything with. Got five five-star Nexuses right here. Uh, I'm going to be going for uh, for Max Sigs, preferably. And if there's no Max Sig, then, um, you know, go for, honestly, whatever else. Cool. Um, there are not going to be any new champs in here. Again, it's just all shards at this point. Every chance I can get to get more six star. Hey, there we go. Um, more six star shards, then that'll be a win. Because I'm hoping inevitably there's a max six star crystal at some point, right? I mean, we're certainly overdue for one. Like it's like it's to the point now where you know people, non whales, casual players. Are starting to max out some of their six stars especially you know with how prestige winds up playing into aq you're the game is heavily incentivized people to invest and max out champions for aq but now you know now what um i'm hoping that they can come up with something clever that doesn't involve seven stars but we'll see right so anything out of here really that isn't uh five star shards would be cool 
Not that, you know, the Sig Stones or the Awakening Gem are exciting, but um, it's just nice to mix things up a little bit, I suppose. You see, that's nice. <sighs> Four more pops. Man, it's kind of ridiculous how hard this dude is to pull out of this crystal, you know? Like, I've been opening up Max Sigs, five star Max Sigs, for a few years, a couple of years at least, and nothing. Like, I've pulled the three star, I think, three times, and the four star, I think, maybe twice at this point, but otherwise. Man. <laughs> I think it's like a 0.1% chance or something crazy like that. Now you got 24 shots here, so I'm going to spin one, pop the others. Uh, I have actually pulled a six-star Immortal Iron Fist on the beta, so it doesn't count, and he was gone within like 30 minutes, honestly, <laughs> the way it wound up breaking down. But I have pulled him once. Kind of. Sort of. Wouldn't that be wild to pull the six star instead of the um, five first? I mean, that's not going to happen, but wouldn't that be something? Alrighty. Now, to wrap things up here, we got one last featured six star crystal. Now, I'm hoping to awaken Nimrod. I'm hoping to awaken Cersei, Ghost Rider, or Dr. Voodoo. Um, honestly, those, those are the four, four champs I'm hoping to pull. Getting 20 more SIGs on Icarus would be hilarious just because I've pulled that dude so many times already, but those are the four. But as this has been announced, I want to thank you guys for watching again, a very happy February to you guys. Uh, how has your immortal iron fist luck been? Let me know in the comment section. I appreciate checking that stuff out. Like the video, subscribe. We'll see you guys next time. This is going to be... Uh, well, I mean, that's an amazing pull. I will happily take 20 more SIGs on Katie Pride. Sweet. Sure. <laughs> I'll take it. All right, guys. Be well, all. I'm Rob Bonchu. Take care, everybody.